bumps, bruises, broken bones. Mothers who have access to Google and think they know everything. Over the years, athletic trainers have seen it all. The most bizarre, the most insane, the craziest, and some of the funniest stories you'll ever hear. Well, Impact Applications went to the NATA convention and we asked them, come behind closed doors and tell us the stories you don't tell anybody else. You won't believe what they had to say. I think it was my second job. I was at a basketball game. I see something fly across the floor. The referee calls a timeout and he calls me out. And I'm like, oh, there's nobody hurt, nobody hurt. And he's like, no, 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 come on, come on, come on out. And I go out to find my uh, coach's teeth on the floor, to which the coach came behind and grabbed his teeth. He's like, I got him, I got him, and shoved him back in his mouth. A football player came in one day and said, do you have any tape remover? I said, yeah, I got plenty of tape remover. Will it work with super glue? He says, well, I got a personal problem. I said, what? I had some super glue in my pocket and it burst open and it glued my scrotum to my inner thigh. So I gave him some tape remover and a towel and I said, good luck. And a team comes off and a girl is looking sick. I bring over the garbage can to her. She looks at me, she looks down at the garbage can and then throws up next to it right on the floor. Huge, huge former wrestler, like basically Jersey meathead. And the dad goes, huh, huh. <sighs> and passed out on the mat. So I simply asked him, what's your name? He's responsive. I know this one. I accidentally knocked over a glass off the table, right? Crashed to the ground, the bar's in an uproar. A little sliver must have just hit my ankle, and we learned I'm a bleeder. There's no cut on my ankle. It's like a little paper cut, and there was blood everywhere. I looked at his eyes, and I was checking his pupils if they were reactive, and his left one was out to here we got to call an ambulance. And the kid said, why? I'm like, your pupil is not moving in that eye. He goes, I got a glass eye. That was the best one I've had. 